This is question 13 uh, from book number one based on the 2020 NEC, and this is electricaltime.com. Bob is relocating the main breaker panel to a different location seven feet away from its original location in the garage of a dwelling unit. Half of the branch circuits are too short to reach the relocated main breaker panel and will need junction boxes and extensions added to them to reach the relocated main breaker panel. None of the existing branch circuits are AFCI protected. Will any of the branch circuits now require AFCI protection? Now let's take a look at the available answers. We've got A. Yes, since the main breaker panel is being moved, all of the branch circuits must now be AFCI protected regardless of the distance of the relocated main breaker panel. B. No, since this is not a new installation which is subject to the new National Electrical Code, it is not required to retroactively require a new code adoption on a relocated main breaker panel. C. Yes, for those branch circuits that were extended more than seven feet to be able to reach the relocated main breaker panel, those branch circuits must now be AFCI protected. Or is the answer D? Yes, for those branch circuits that were extended more than six feet to be able to reach the relocated main breaker panel, those branch circuits must now be AFCI protected. And the answer to this question is D, and that is yes, for those branch circuits that were extended more than six feet to be able to reach the relocated main breaker panel, those branch circuits must now be AFCI protected. All right, so let's take a look and see how we found the answer to this question. So the first question we're going to ask ourselves. Hi, this is Steve with electricaltime.com. Uh, before we get back to our video, just want to show you our website real quick. It's called electricaltime.com, and we got some really cool things here. We've got online electrical classes, so go check them out. And also, we got free videos, so go back to our website each week and you know check out our free videos. All right, now back to this video. Is what article are we talking about here? And that's going to be Article 210 for Branch Circuits. And that's within Chapter 2, Wiring and Protection. And in Article 210, we find Part 1, which is titled General Provisions. And then we find 210.12, and that is called Arc Fault Circuit Interrupter Protection. And then we find 210.12D, and that's called Branch Circuit Extensions or Modifications and we also have to look at the exception of 210.12D. And let's read that together in our code book. And if you don't have your code book, just go back to our website, electricaltime.com, buy your code book, buy your tabs. And here's what it says in 210.12D exception. AFCI protection shall not be required where the extension of the existing branch circuit conductors is not more than six feet and does not include any additional outlets or devices other than splicing devices. This measurement shall not include the conductors inside an enclosure, cabinet, or junction box. And that's what it says. All right, so six feet is that magic number that they're giving us this exception to. So let's take a look in our electricaltime.com book and let's see what we have for our commentary. 210.12D exception allows us to relocate the main breaker panel in this example so that we are not required to install AFCI breakers for those branch 
circuits, provided we do not extend those branch circuits more than six feet. A very common example is when we are installing a new main breaker panel right next to the old main breaker panel, and we start moving the branch circuits from the old panel to the new panel. As long as you are not extending those branch circuits more than six feet, this exception can come in very handy and not require you to purchase AFCI breakers, which you may not have included in your original estimate for the job. Personally, I would explain the importance of the AFCI breakers to my customer, and I would have strongly recommended them. So again, the answer is going to be D, and that is going to be yes for those branch circuits that were extended more than six feet to be able to reach the relocated main breaker panel. Those branch circuits must now be AFCI protected as per 210.12D and 210.12D exception.